Hey IG Garage family, have you ever tried to start your car only for it to stutter, shake and throw up an error code? If your OBD2 scanner is flashing P0315, you might be dealing with a crankshaft position sensor problem. Stick around because today I'll explain what this code means, where to find the sensor and how to fix the issue. Trust me, you don't want to miss this one. So what does P0315 actually mean? The P0315 code indicates crankshaft position system variation not learned. In simpler terms, it means your engine control module, ECM, isn't able to learn the specific crankshaft position. This can lead to poor engine performance, difficulty starting or even stalling while driving. Now let's talk about where this crankshaft position sensor is located. Typically, you'll find it near the bottom of the engine, close to the crankshaft pulley. Depending on your vehicle, it might be mounted on the engine block or transmission bell housing. This sensor is crucial because it sends data to the ECM about the position of the crankshaft, helping to ensure that your engine runs smoothly. If this sensor fails or if the ECM loses its ability to recognize it, you'll get that pesky P0315 code. Common symptoms of a P0315 code include difficulty starting the engine, rough idling, and reduced power while driving. The main culprits can be a faulty crankshaft position sensor issues with the wiring or connectors or even problems with the ECM itself. To fix this code, start by inspecting the crankshaft position sensor and its wiring. Make sure there are no frayed wires or loose connections. If everything looks good but you're still having issues, it might be time to replace the sensor. Once you replace the crankshaft position sensor, clear the code using your OBD2 scanner and take your car for a test drive. This should help the ECM relearn the crankshaft position and resolve the issue. That's how you troubleshoot the P0315 code. If this video was helpful, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to IG Garage for more car repair tips. Before you go, check out these two related videos. First, watch our video on P0012, where we discuss issues with the camshaft timing, and don't miss our video on P0068, where we cover problems with the MAP-MAF sensor correlation. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.